Hello, my name is Nirav and uh, today uh, with me is Mr. Abhila Sonwane, who is the Vice President of Product Management for Cyberome. And uh, Abhilash is going to talk to us today about uh, the new Cyberome version X, which is the latest version of Cyberome uh, Unified Threat Management solution. Welcome Abhilash. Yeah, hello Nirav. Abhilash, the product team has been working on uh, version X since the past year. Can you share us uh, the, some key developments on this project? Yes, Nirav. Uh, we are very excited about this new version X. It's the latest and greatest version of CyberO. The development team has been working hard and one of the key goals of this version X was to remove the clutter of unified threat management appliances. The key features that we have been adding in this version was simplified web 2.0 GUI, layer 7 application control, instant messaging control and management, HTTPS scanning and certain key wireless functionalities and not to forget the IPv6 ready appliance firmware. Application firewall isn't really new to the market. Is there anything special about Cyberum's application firewall? That's an interesting question Nirav. Application firewalls have been around but the focus of those application firewalls has been blocking port hopping applications like P2P and instant messaging applications. Now with cloud computing revolution, we have seen that good applications are running on single ports like HTTP and HTTPS ports. There is a need to assure the performance of these business applications in this era. With version X, we have come up with layer 7 application identification along with bandwidth management that assures performance of business applications. What do you wish to achieve with the IM and HTTPS scanning functionality? We at Cyberome believe that instant messaging is one of the productivity enhancement tools for an organization. It helps organizations reduce costs and save time. But it comes with this inherent risk of loss of productivity and even certain data leakage implications. With the new instant messaging control and management feature, the version X firmware would enable administrators to control who can chat to whom who can use webcam and voice features about IM, thus enabling the organizations to use IM in a productive fashion. To prevent data leakage, the version X comes with an interesting feature of controlling file uh, upload through instant messaging as well as we can even archive the files that are being transferred over instant messaging. This enables organizations to use instant messaging without the risk of data leakage happening. Talking about HTTPS scanning, lately we have seen is that malware propagation is happening over secure HTTP. In addition to the users using HTTPS for data leakage, we have seen instances of malicious user uploading files over HTTPS, taking advantage of firewalls that don't have visibility on the HTTPS protocol. With version X, we change that whereby the HTTPS protocol is scanned for malware and we can also control what files can be transferred over HTTPS. There is a reporting feature that's available on HTTPS which gives reports to the administrator which files are being transferred over SSL. Can you talk something about the Cyberome's new wireless functionality? With Cyberome version X, we have wireless enablement on both sides of the appliance. We have wireless connectivity for uh, WiMAX and uh, 3G on the WAN side as well as we have come up with a Wi-Fi appliance range that would enable wireless security on the LAN side. Last question, how can our customers be so sure that they've got a true IPv6 solution? While we were developing IPv6 feature, we discovered that there weren't many IPv6 enabled networks around that made testing of real life environments very tough. So what was the best way to assure customers that this appliance is IPv6 ready appliance. We found that there was a IPv6 ready logo committee which assured customers about the IPv6 interoperability of network components. We went ahead and did the testing and have got the IPv6 ready logo, IPv6 ready gold logo to assure that Cyberum works very well in an IPv6 enabled environment. I would suggest that customers use the IPv6 ready logo to verify whether their network components are IPv6 ready or IPv6 enabled. 
Thank you, Abhilash, for uh, sharing with us the vision behind version X functionality. Yeah, thanks, Nirav. It was a pleasure.